Well, after plenty of pre-match anticipation, the wait is finally over. My name is Derek Ray. I'm joined by Stuart Robson in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a spectacular final. It's Inter up against Juventus. Well, Derek, what a game this should be. Both teams have done really well to get this far, but who will be lifting the cup at the end of the game? I'm sure it'll be a classic, though. Well, so many reasons to highlight Lautaro Martinez, not least because he can be so effective. Stuart, what do you think we might see from him in this game? Well, Derek, he's brilliant in the air, so I expect crossing to be a big part of their game plan today. Making the pitch big, getting the ball out wide, and deliver as many crosses into the box as possible. Inter's lineup is as follows. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Milan Striniar in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays alongside Edin Dzeko. And this is how Juventus will line up. Wojciech Szczesny is the goalkeeper. Paul Pogba plays alongside Adria Rabio in the centre of the park. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. A game that should have plenty to say for itself. Juventus kick off. Alexandro Kostic has it will he play it in but the keeper takes command very clear who got the last touch so a corner coming up well he made great contact with that one but the goalkeeper had his own ideas another corner Thumps clear. Danilo. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Can he find the right pass? Can he convert? Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Charanolu. Martinez. Now Dzeko, and with that, the attack fizzles out. Dzeko, and the cross smuggled away. Locatelli. The Bianconeri have given it away. Federico Di Marco. A very effective challenge put in. Moving it forward. Must take the lead here. Oh, but he's missed it. How on earth is this still level? Well, I just don't know, Derek. Just a real lack of composure in the end. They should be ahead now. Danilo. And beating the defender. It needs an accurate cross. But a corner to Juventus, and perhaps an opportunity for the old lady to jump ahead.
Playing it in. The clearance wasn't decisive. And pretty routine for the goalkeeper. Well, that tells the story perfectly. Juve's build-up play has been very good. Their finishing has been poor. And that's why they're only level here. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Juventus. Giving the ball away. Chalanoru. Barella has it. Dzeko. And intercepted it. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. No possibilities in the centre. In position. Oh, a goal for Juve! It's the opening statement in the final. Exactly what they were hoping for. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. So it is, the first half story has been written. Well, they get the ball rolling in the second half, and the responsibility falls on Inter to bounce back here. Determined defending. Quadrado. Chalanolu. Well read to ease the pressure. Quadrado. Di Maria. Martinez. An important interception. The object of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward. That's what they're doing. Well, not the best clearance. And Quadrado feeds it in. And well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. And he takes it on. It's still alive. Another play and an inter throw in coming up. Time for the change now. Barella. Dzeko. Well, Juventus have it back here. And Inter might be able to cash in here. Nice and easy for the keeper. Dzeko. High quality defending. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Breaking at pace. Vlahovic. Oh, great attacking play. It has to be.
Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder, but there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. So 2-0 now. And we've entered the final five minutes. Federico Di Marco. Dzeko. Firing it towards goal. And caught by the keeper. Di Maria. So now a corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? It comes to nothing in the end. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled.